Hi everyone, this is DJ. Amazon Fire TV devices are one of the most popular and most used devices in the world. Most people, they just use them for streaming their favorite content like Prime Video, Netflix, Disney Plus, and so on. But most people are not aware that there's so much more you can do with your Fire TV device and the Fire TV remote besides streaming. Starting with this video, I will be doing a series of Amazon tips and tricks so you can get the most out of your Amazon Fire TV device. Today's tip will be switch TV inputs using your Fire TV second or third gen remote. So let's get right to it right after this. In order to be able to switch TV inputs, you will need to have either a Fire Edition Smart TV that has a remote like this, or a second or a third gen Fire TV voice remote. Pretty much you need one that has the power and the volume buttons on there. As you can see, the Fire Stick Lite that came out in 2020. The actual device has the capability. There's no power and volume buttons on this one, and it's the remote that now will not work. Once you have the correct remote, you need to make sure you have the correct TV set up with your device. So if you're using a Fire Edition Smart TV, you can skip this part. So if we go back to our home screen here, you need to go to your settings, the little gear icon over here. You're gonna scroll down to equipment control, select that, then go in and go down to where it says manage equipment. And we're gonna to scroll to TV and scroll all the way down to change TV. In here, it will show you which TV is currently set up with your Fire TV device. Some people use it on a one TV first to set it up and then they move it to another one. If that's the case, then you need to change the TV. All you gotta do is just click on change TV, select change TV again, and it will detect the one that you're using. All right, now, once you have the correct remote and the correct TV set up, now to be able to switch inputs, let's go to our home page. All right, let's bring the remote up. Now, all you need to do, you're gonna press and hold the microphone button, and you're gonna say, switch to the input name that you wanna to switch to, like HDMI one or antenna or whichever input you wanna to switch to. You're gonna release, and then you're gonna to point towards your TV. So for example, switch to antenna input. You're gonna release and point towards your TV. There you go, switches right over. If you want to go back to an HDMI input, switch to HDMI 1, release, and point. And that's it. All right. Pretty simple. A lot faster than trying to find the TV remote to switch an input. So what do you guys think? Leave me a comment in the comment section below. I would love to know your thoughts. All right, I think that should do it for today. If you guys like this video, please give me a thumbs up. It does let YouTube know you like what I do here and it does help my channel grow. Also click on subscribe and the little bell icon to get notified of any new videos that I upload. Thank you for watching. This is DJ. Till next time.